Last week's drama dominated the State of the Province Address debate today. Members of the Northwest Provincial Legislature reflected on the events in which the Democratic Alliance walked out and the EFF was kicked out. EFF lawmakers were apparently assaulted by the legislature's security. The speaker, Susanna Danchi, is blamed for the incident. Speaker, when you call upon the security personnel to remove members in the violent manner it was conducted, it reminded us of Marikana. This is similar in that even the Marikana, in Marikana, someone in a position of <coughs> Authority authorized the shooting of the minors. Here, you authorized the manhandling and attacks on members. The DA says Danji infringed on the members' freedom of expression. What happened here last week was infringing on the freedom of members. Before ruling out a point of order as frivolous, it must be put to test. Sadly, you seemed determined to shut down a democratic process, rendering the wins and gains that past parliaments had made with free speech and null and void. The EFF is calling for the suspension of all the provincial legislature's security personnel implicated in the assault of their members. You further instructed the tracks of the ANC that you employed under the disguise of the legislature security officers to deal with us and their action clearly showed that they were unqualified and their acts were premeditated. And honorable speaker, these unqualified security officers who assaulted us must be, must be, dis, must be suspended with immediate effect. Meanwhile, other ANC members of the provincial legislature urged their government employees to improve service delivery. Honorable Speaker, the silence of those given responsibility by the ANC to deliver the services to our people leaves a lot to be desired. The silence received by the community of Ostri, Mushwana and the neighboring Tlachameng areas on a commitment done to them cannot be given a blind eye and as it does not represent the ANC on which 70% of the people in those areas have voted for the ANC in the recent national and provincial elections. Premier Mokhoro is expected to respond to the debate on Thursday. Silwane Khaun, SABC News, Mahikeng.